Mary Patrick. Uh, I'm just going for the record have uh, opposition to the hearing itself that wasn't uh, advertised correctly and uh, for there to be no agenda posted at all for the hearing on 1-5. This board specifically said on December 29th there would be no meeting on 1-5 at all and uh, this uh, Hearings like this have to be scheduled for two weeks in advance, which they were not in the paper. It was not scheduled. It was not posted correctly in the paper. They had one uh, thing Thursday evening uh, in the paper this past Thursday for this meeting tonight, which doesn't conform to your own policies. So, uh, for one commissioner to come up here and say he opens a meeting, and closes it to do it again. I think it's totally against the policy that you have on the book. So when you start breaking policy for one, then you're going to break it for everybody. Or well, then you're going to have a problem. Thank you, ma'am. Uh, I would uh, refer to the county <coughs> chairman, I mean the county attorney on that. Uh, the legality of the thing. We will hold an additional hearing. Is that not correct? Yeah, you're, you're actually holding a continuous hearing tonight. So if anybody was confused about the hearing on the 5th, We'll catch them tonight. If they were confused about it being on the fifth, they had an opportunity there, at which I understand the commissioner Salmon basically announced that they would have the right to come back to this hearing. Yeah. So it was noticed well and okay. proper. We have heard. Uh